athletes qualifying for the uh, senior boys 100 meters finals rubi running a uh, sub 11 uh, seconds and that's of course um super grammar's isake mana queen victoria school senderusi raunge and super grammar's semesa Vanginivalu, all running under 11 seconds in their heats to qualify for this uh, final so it's going to be a really interesting one uh, in the uh, senior boys 100 meters final so the uh, athletes have been marched onto the tracks and uh, they've started this uh, a couple of years ago where uh, they uh, present the runners the finalists in the 100 meters they only do it in the 100 meters because that's like the highlight event of uh, the games or any uh, athletics competition and uh, they've been marched from the uh, finish line on the tracks right to the uh, start where the uh, spectators get to uh, see their favorite athletes or their star athletes that will be running for that gold medal in the senior boys 100 meters so uh, now all the athletes are lined up at the uh, start line and just checking their blocks we'll take a look at the uh, list of runners in the uh, senior boys 100 meters the last track event of the day that we're about to call for you in lane one is Meli Tubusa of Natambua High School. In lane two, Penea Ramasirai of uh, MGM. In lane three, Aisake Mana of Suvagrama. In lane four, Senirusi Raunge of uh, Queen Victoria School. In lane five, Semesa Vanginivalu of Suvagrama School. In lane six, Ravuama Latilevu of Maris Brothers High School. In lane seven, Chosevani uh, Ramaratha of uh, Bawani Dayal, and uh, in lane 8, in Nokembera of Lambasa College. Ramaratha, Bawani Dayal, he clocked the time of 11.19, and he's confident and he looks very relaxed uh, before the start. He's smiling, and he says he's got that underdog mentality, he's got nothing to lose. And of course, he's going to give it his all. So there you go, that's the uh, list of runners in this uh, 100 meters Final, Senior Boys, Blue Ribbon, the last track event of the day. Yes. Sorry, Tony, just a correction, uh, not a correction, just a bit of a change in the uh, Senior Girls Bronze Medal. Uh, like I said, it was a photo finish uh, in, the, in the Bronze Medal. Eva Fifita of Silver Grammar has claimed bronze in the uh, 100 meters Senior Girls Final. So there's your confirmation and we'll bring our attention back to the uh, Senior Boys um, 100 meters finals, the uh, blue ribbon event that's about to get uh, underway. Lane uh, three, four, and five. That's that's the spotlight lane. That's of course featuring uh, Isakeban of Suvagrama, Senirusi Raunge of QVS, and Semesa Danginivalu of Suvagrama. The fastest qualifiers, these three runners running under 11 seconds from their heats. So three, four, and five. Senirusi Raunge is uh, in uh, lane four, so he's in the middle of Isake Mana of Suvagrama and Semesa Ranginivalu of uh, also of Suvagrama. So there you have it. He's been boxed in by the uh, Suvagrama runners. And as I said earlier on, take nothing away from the rest of the runners. Josefani. Ramaratha coming to uh, spoil the party. Senior boys 100 meters about to get uh, underway. And uh, the blue ribbon event. Senior boys 100 meters. The last track event, the highlight event of the games and uh, of today of course. Senior boys, 100 meters, about to get uh, underway. Officials still going through their checks. The spectators, let's just describe it for you. We've got uh, MGM, who's at the uh, center of the uh, grandstand. They've taken up that whole area. They're all uh, at their feet at the, at the moment. They've got uh, their runner, Penea Ramisirai, who's uh, in this uh, race, and he's in lane two. RK, uh, rather, uh, Marist. They're uh, stationed in the uh, grandstand, the supporters at the uh, finish line, just in line with the uh, finish line. They're all at their feet as well, and right beside them is Suva Grammar. So on the tracks, the first call has been made, and the athletes take their marks. As I said, the spotlight 
will be on three, four, and five. Raonge in between the two Suva Grammar runners. Set, and they're off, and that looks like a false start from Tuvusa of Natambua. And this might be a disqualification. This might come down to a disqualification. Marika. There you go. That's uh, just uh, coming down to the uh, officials. They're just having a discussion right now. It looked like a uh, false start and it just might be a disqualification. No, we're just waiting for that. Uh, we're just waiting for that confirmation from the uh, officials. They're still in the, having their discussion. And let's just see who the uh, athlete is. Yes, it's uh, Tuvusa of Natambua. He has been uh, disqualified for the uh, false start as he uh, wishes everybody else the best. And uh, it's just, uh, well, that's what it's come down to. He's clocked an impressive time of 11.31 seconds from the, uh, the uh, heats. And maybe he was just hoping that uh, a really good bullet start, a legal bullet start would give him an edge but uh, he overcooked it on that occasion. So he's been ejected, and the race proper will continue. So no Natambua represented in this race. On your marks, the first call has been made. 100 meters, senior boys, blue ribbon event. Who's the fastest secondary school's athlete? And it looks like another false start. And this time, the MGM supporters, the body language does not look good from the supporters. They've got their hands on their head. And the uh, camera, what's being shown on the big screen here at the HFC Bank uh, Stadium is the uh, MGM runner. And he knows, he knows himself. Body language doesn't look good. Penea Ramasirai of MGM. So two possible two uh, disqualifications just pending that uh, confirmation from the uh, track officials. And uh, it's just everybody's, all the supporters of MGM in the grandstand, they're standing with the same stance and gesture, hands on their head. And uh, they were hoping for an upset from uh, their athlete. So uh, we'll just wait confirmation. And of course, that's confirmation too. So two ejections from the uh, senior boys, 100 meters. It's just drama here at the HFC Bank Stadium. So there you go, Natambua disqualified for a false start. And on the uh, recall, the restart, it was MGM with the uh, disqualification. So now we've got uh, Subagrama QVS, Subagrama Marist, Bawani Dayal, and Lambasa College in that order. Of course, that's uh, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So waiting for the uh, first call to be made. Senior boys, 100 meters. That's two disqualifications. And let's just hope there won't be a third disqualification. So the first call has been made. The runners, they take their marks. Senior boys, 100 meters. Set. And they're off, and it's a perfect start. And a powerful start from Zanginibalu over Super Grandma. And he powers to the lead in the last 50 meters to go. A gap of two meters between him and Raunge of QVS. And it will be Super Grandma Semesa. Zanginibalu over Super Grandma with the gold. A clear cut gold, a clear cut win. But we'll get indication of a second and third place from Mosese. Yes, that was a great run from uh, Semesa Vaginivalu, who has defended his uh, Blue Ribbon title for 2024, scooping gold in that 100 meter final. And in second place, uh, his teammate, Isake Mana, who is also from Suva Grammar School. And in third place is QVS uh, 
Senrusi Raunge. So there you go. That's confirmation. The fastest schoolboy of 2024. And that title will go to uh, Super Grammar's Semesa Ranginibalu. And he's managed to defend his uh, title. What a run from him. The power run from the beginning. And he held it at the 50 meter mark. The clear separation. It didn't need a photo finish to indicate who the uh, gold medal would go to. And of course, he will take that uh, gold medal. It would be interesting to see what time he clocked as well. I'm sure it's well outside of the uh, record, but that was pretty fast from Vanginibalo uh, of Suvagram. Yang daripada tengah kan, biar tu na, terus terus kami di tinggal re, na bukni blue ribbon na, terus kami 